My name is Dave Rogers. I'm a disabled veteran artist in Patchogue, New York. Uh, this is my service dog, Grunt. Um, wherever I go, he goes. <laughs> I was in the Army for 14 years, uh, but I've always wanted to be an artist since I was a little kid. When I was 10 years old, I told my mother I wanted to be an artist. And she took me down to Washington Square Park where the artists used to sit and draw. And she goes, if you became an artist, this would be your life. Five dollars a drawing, sitting out here all day. And at 10 years old, five dollars a drawing seemed like a lot of money. I was like, wow, this is a great life. I, I want to do this for sure. I knew I wanted to be an artist since I could pick up a pencil. I mean, it just came to me naturally. You know, that didn't mean I didn't have things to learn. We all have things. I'm still learning. I'm still growing as an artist. I don't think we ever stop growing as an artist. Um, but yeah, since I could pick up a pencil, I was, I was like, this is what I want to do with the rest of my life. Um, for me, it's a work ethic. There's this idea that artists are lazy or artists don't really uh, put a lot of time or effort into what they do. But the truth of the matter is that there is a lot of uh, research and study. There's a lot of science behind art. You know, I make my own colors from pigment, from scratch. I, I stretch my own canvas a lot of the times. You know, I do research on, on who I'm creating if I'm doing a musician series or something. It's a hard work ethic to be a great artist. You have to find your niche in the art world, and that could take you 15, 20, 25, maybe 30 years. And if you're not willing to put in the work to get there, it'll never happen. You gotta work it um, every day. Um, you know, the great thing about art is that art should create a conversation. You know, if people look at a piece of work and they're wondering what it's about and they're wondering what's going on and they're trying to figure it out, um, then you've accomplished your job as an artist. And that's what I try to do. You can tell a dark story in a very beautiful painting. And that's the great thing about art. Is what you see and what the reality is is not always the same thing. I would say the biggest advice I have for young artists is take risks. If art is what you really love, do art. And it's hard. It's not easy. Nothing like easy. But if you believe in what you're doing, you love what you're doing, and you put the effort into it, you'll get the reward out of it, just like anything else.